But we're hearing from the family of that San Jose store clerk who was gunned down while trying to stop a robbery. Manuel Huizar Cornejo was gunned down on the job at Safeway over the weekend, and still no arrests have been made. Three days later, his killer is still on the loose. And SKPX 5's Andrea Borber reports all his family has now are tears, memories, and questions. Wearing his baby brother Manny's Raiders jersey, Guillermo Huizar is heartbroken. I just gotta say I miss him. I miss him so much. I wish he'd come home soon, you know? Manny is not coming home. The 24-year-old, described as hardworking, dedicated, and sweet, was gunned down inside the Safeway he worked at for six years early Sunday morning. Never mentioned uh, she was going to go to work and don't come back, you know? At this Safeway in San Jose's Willow Glen neighborhood, Manny made an impression. His family said they didn't organize the growing memorial on Hamilton Avenue. Manny's customers keep showing up with flowers, food, and candles. It's one of the things keeping us strong, keeping us strong to see all that love. Mom Maricela is crushed over the loss of her youngest child, her sweet baby. She says, though, the outpouring of community and seeing the number of people Manny affected helps with the overwhelming grief. But people really, really touch my heart. Really, really touch my heart. I'm speechless. Manny's family is trying to plan his funeral. It'll probably be in a few weeks. You know, when someone dies, you, you can say, you're in a better place, but I don't think she's in a better place. I think he's still young, 24 years, you know? He had a lot of future. San Jose PD have footage from inside that 24-hour Safeway where the shooting happened, but still at this point have not caught Manny's killer. In San Jose, Andrea Borba, KPIX 5.